you guys feeling? Good. Yeah? Happy fall. It's fall now. Um, I'm going as Ellen this year. Yes. I went to Starbucks today, and I did not order a pumpkin spice latte. I was immediately arrested and detained in white girl jail. <laughs> Dustin bailed me out. Thank you. Everybody's pissed that an Indian woman won Miss America. Guys, don't hate Miss America for being Indian, please. Hate her for being prettier than you. <laughs> hate her for doing pageants. Hate her because they gave her her own reality show. Woo! Yeah. Here comes Nina Boo Boo. <laughs> Google released the new Android update this week. They're calling it Kit Kat. They wanted to name it after something that would break easily. <laughs> Is writing these jokes. Give me a break. <laughs> we got a great show for you guys tonight. Yeah! yeah. yeah. Colin Chamberlain is here. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Roscoe Wicked is here. He's gonna rap for us. Yeah. That was the whitest thing I've ever done in my life. I apologize. <laughs> Ali Spagnola is here, you guys. Queen of the Power Hour. Yes. Who's excited, guys? All right, we'll be right back. Hi, I'm Sarah e. Wellesby. And I'm Dustin Dowling. And, and we're, we're about, about to bear our souls. We're filmmakers from Pittsburgh. We've worked on everything from music videos to short films. And now we're doing a talk show. Every other week, we bring in featured guests, musical guests, and comedians to come perform in our live studio audience. It's actually my basement. It's just her basement. But we've actually managed to make three episodes so far by only paying our crew with food and beer. Yeah, we're broke. Like, we can't even afford Sarah's medication anymore. And Dustin's starving. So hungry. And I really don't want to go back to little ponies inside the That was my name, and I kids, and everybody was watching me while I was his and her fucking them, and Yeah, I don't want to do that with old dudes again. Yeah, so she doesn't have to do that. How about you guys just pledge to our Kickstarter campaign? We've got calendars and t-shirts and, and stickers. You guys can also get our DVD, the full season of eight episodes with bonus features and behind the scenes. So pledge to our Kickstarter campaign and let's keep this party going. Actually have to get naked for this, Dustin. We have a hilarious comedian here for you tonight. He was Arcade Comedy Theater's class clown. He's so hilarious. Guys, welcome Colin Chamberlain. What's up, party show? <laughs> All right, that's enough. <laughs> How about the weather, huh? Summer's almost over, huh? Yeah, it is. Get a calendar. Pay attention. You guys feel free to... to have some input in this. You know, I know we're in a basement. Is there a gas leak? Is there enough ventilation in here? <laughs> <laughs> Woo, this should go over really good. <laughs> yeah. But I'm glad summer's almost over because I hate the heat. Uh, I started putting on some weight recently. I stopped exercising, which apparently that'll do it. And my nutritionist, my nutritionist didn't even say anything. I walked into his office. I was like, hey, doc, you told me if I stopped exercising. He was like, let me stop you right there. You can call me by my first name. I was like, hey, Burger King, if you told me I stop exercising. Thank you. Uh, when you're overweight and you have glasses, you're immediately compared to anyone else who's overweight and has glasses. Let me, let me give you an example. A couple years ago, there was a Domino's commercials out, and uh, there was this lady in the commercial. She was fat, had short brown hair, and glasses. And my friends were like, hey, Cole, you know who you look like? <laughs> that fat lesbian with the short brown hair and glasses from the Domino's commercial. I was like, thanks, guys. So I was feeling real down and real hungry for Domino's, so I went to my local Domino's. 
I walk in, they're like, hey, aren't you that fat lesbian from the commercial? I was like, yeah, I am. It was awesome. They gave me like six meat lovers pizza for free. And then on the way out, four lesbians hit on me. And, and it was pretty cool. Like, lesbians get a bad rap. They're really nice. Like, they taught me how to throw a softball. They showed me what it means to be a real man. They, they picked all the sausage off their pizza and gave it to me, which was strange because I enjoyed it. My mom was a food pusher growing up. Uh, to give you an example, um, like when my dad and my mom got a divorce, she came in and she was like, hey, uh, your dad and I aren't going to live together anymore and we don't love each other. And I was like, aw. But then she was, <laughs> as all kids react. <laughs> then she was like, but I got you a Happy Meal. I was like, aw. <laughs> but then I began to learn that Happy Meals were actually sad meals because trouble was right around the corner. She came home one day with a small fry from McDonald's, and she was like, hey, I picked you up a small fry. By the way, the dog has been kind of sluggish. Shouldn't, shouldn't be a problem. The next day, she comes home with chicken nuggets and a Junior Frosty, and she's like, hey, I dropped the dog off at the vet just for a routine checkup. She comes in the next day with six cheeseburgers, a bucket of ice cream. <laughs> she hands me a shovel and says, meet me out back because we have to bury Spot. <clears throat> That was kind of rough. <laughs> Folks, that's a dog pun. <laughs> try, to, try to keep up. Some of these are slow burners. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, my mom used to get me Mighty Kids Meals. Anyone remember Mighty Kids Meals? Do we have any six-year-olds in the audience tonight? <laughs> Is Joe killed in the third grade? <laughs> uh, they were like extra beef patty, bigger drink, bigger fries. You're supposed to give kids fuel, and they actually gave them like diabetes. But she got them for me before I went to T-Ball, and I was like warming up. I'm just sitting there like, uh, uh, uh. and the coach is like, Chamberlain, get your glove on and go catch some foul balls. Uh, uh, uh. That's my T-Ball career, by the way. Go catch some foul balls. <laughs> they were like, hey, you little asthmatic turd. You're lucky we gave you a uniform. <laughs> Meanwhile, the kid in the commercial eats one, and he's running wind sprints with Ray Lewis. But if Ray Lewis was chasing me, I'd run pretty fast, too. That's all my time. Thank you. That was hilarious. Thank you, Colin. We'll be right back with Ali Spagnola. <laughs> Guys, please welcome the queen of the power hour, Ali Spagnola. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me about the power hour and the drinking every minute kind of thing. Well, you do every hour, right? Every minute, yeah. Every so, minute. Well, the game is you drink a shot of beer every minute for an hour. And my game is an album of 60 songs. They're all one minute long, so you know when to drink. You guys hear that? You guys going to do it with me? Woo! Yeah. Woo! All right. We got a 10 to 15 minute interview depending on how drunk I get. So we're going to do this every minute. Somebody, you guys, somebody time me. All right, minute one, one here we go. Two, three. Cheers. This is it. <laughs> Tell me about your tour. Um, I'm headed out on tour in October to November, actually. I'm going to hit about 30 cities across the U.S. Holy cow. You've got this little legal battle that you just... Won. Yeah, yes. you won it. Heck yeah. Well, you, you, you ruined the story. You gave it away. No, like, like no one knew that that would happen. Uh, yeah, somebody said he claimed to own Power Hour. And like, I don't know, it's like saying, uh, I invented poker and no one can play poker anymore, which is BS. So I took him to court and kicked his butt. Nice. Thank you. Do you, you drink a lot. Define a lot. It's all relative. You drink more than me. <laughs> I don't know. I'm a lightweight. I hear you are too. Yeah, I am. Uh, that's that. Uh, yeah. I, am. I think in volume. I think we're both probably drink on the same volume. level. Drink. So we're. Yeah, girl. It's 
nice shot glass you have there, by the way. Yes, I appreciate please. that you're using that. Uh, please tell me about this. This is crazy. That, that is my album. You were drinking out of my album. Hey. Hello. Yeah. I don't hear anything. Okay. Yeah. There it is. Yep. I got it. If you drink enough, you will hear. <laughs> Tell me about this thing. What? A, so your music is on here? Yeah, yeah. It's a USB and a shot glass and a and party I'm... starter and a sweet accessory you were wearing earlier. Okay. So you, uh, you've got some music on the Bad Girls Club. I do. I do. Yeah. You're a fan of the Bad Girls Club? Uh, I've actually never seen it, but Dustin loves the Bad Girls Club. <laughs> he is a bad girl. He actually auditioned for the show. Oh, yeah? Do we have a clip? Can we roll the clip? Can we show the clip, guys? I'm Dustin. I'm from Fort City, and I'm real as I'm a classy ass bitch. I run Fort City. I run that city. I don't like fake I don't like cheese on my pizza. I hate stink bugs. And I hate when the cats get in my garbage. I make videos. It just makes dudes wanna f me. Makes bitches wanna f me. Cows wanna f me. F run this town. I got a debit card. B Turn up. Turn up. I'm all glam and no ham. Mmm. Look at that. Oh! Shut the f up. Shut the f up. Real as f Meet me down at the saloon. I be getting. I be getting hoes. Go Sabres, turn up. F***ing hair! Bitches. I've been to this city before. I know how to get down 28. Shut up! Shut up. Ah! Alright girl, alright, I got you. My heroes are Miley Cyrus, Alicia Keys, and Foreplay from Pretty Ricky. <laughs> turn up. Turn up, turn up, turn up. Turn up. I never miss church on Sunday, turn up. I can eat whatever I want and I never gain weight. I'm a bad bitch. Can I twerk now? I go hard. All right, well, we're gonna bring the next Thank you. Bring! Bring me! Yeah. <laughs> hey, they didn't take him. Can you believe it? <laughs> I'm, I'm surprised. <laughs> Not bad <laughs> enough. This is a fun game. So tell them what they have to do for your songs. Okay, so this is the fourth song in my Power Hour, which is also a mini drinking game within the big drinking game. So, because we just started, you guys could get a little more into it. So every time I say the word game, you have to take another sip. Here we go. Woo! Okay. Who's ready? Who needs a beer? Because I have a stupid amount of beer over here. Oh, pay attention because it happens a lot. Since we just started and you're still kind of bored. Andrew waiting there with your shot already poured. Let's play the game within the game. Every time I sing the word, a game to you. You've got to take a sip of your brew. It's the game within the game. So if you're following in time, you'll know you're already five sips behind. It's the game within the game. This game can be lots of fun, especially if I say the word a game a ton. Game! Following along for this whole thing. Wow! It's the game, 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 game within the game. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Yeah! Yeah! Woo! That's fun. <laughs> uh, what? Woo! Well, give me a second. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the song gets better as you go. I what? get more talented too. <laughs> Uh, excuse me. <laughs> what made you think of that is crazy. Drink. <laughs> well, be, it's the fourth song, so there's not, like, the beginning of a party, everyone's still sort of getting into it, so why not add a little more challenge and a lot more beer? Yeah! yeah. I love it. Yeah! Um, so what gave, what made you think of, like, the whole, like, touring, drinking? Was it just because you went to college and you were just like... <laughs> Woo, party! Yeah, I did not go to college, if you couldn't tell. I never <laughs> went there. Um, but what gave you this idea? To well, well, I mean, I was playing Power Hours. It's a pretty common game, and we were playing in college, and I was also playing music. But my shows were kind of like, 
not a party. And so when I married the two, then it was like I was inviting people to a game and to, you know, drink and party and burp instead of <laughs> instead of just coming to hear me strum a guitar. Oh my gosh. Drink! Okay. Hello. He's good at this. You're hired. Come on tour with me. <laughs> Who's driving me home tonight? <laughs> Woo! Yeah! Oh, I liquid her. car. I Have her. you heard of that? This, no. I sing about a liquid car in my album. It's nice. basically you get drunk enough and you can walk anywhere and think that you drove. Do it for us? Oh, that song? All right. All right. All right, so it's called Liquid Blank, so it's about different things that, that can come about whenever you're drunk that, that'll get you places. If it's cold out, and you don't like it Take another shot for a liquid blanket Or or maybe it's wet out and you're not a rain kind of fellow Well, finish your beer, you'll need a liquid umbrella You're really drunk, but you gotta travel far Turn that feeling into a liquid car Or you're outside and the snow is falling on your head Thank goodness you've got that liquid sled. Uh -huh. If you're almost passing out, you won't hit the cement and say ouch, cause you can lay yourself down on that liquid couch. Uh -huh. So you're not that strong, but you want a tough guy badge. Take a little sip of that liquid courage. Did you bring anything I could puke into? <laughs> I got you, girl. I got you, girl. <laughs> All right, we're going to bring out our next guest. He's been in the scene for a while. He's been doing his thing since I can remember. I remember turning 21 and watching this kid in Commonwealth Family. Please bring out Roscoe. Wicked! <laughs> Thank you, sorry. <laughs> Give me a second to get some. You good? Oh, I'm great. Too much of the game? <laughs> well, well, too that much. That is impossible, <laughs> sir. There's, not, there's never too much of the game. Nope. Never, ever. Dude, you're doing a ton of stuff. Thank you, thank you. I, try. I got a couple questions for you, though, that I've been wondering. I did not ask you, you know, personally, because I didn't know. You still with Commonwealth Family? Yeah. That, yes? Yeah. Oh my God, I'm so happy to hear that. I am so happy to hear that. Matter of fact, we just started our next album. It's sounding pretty good. We're working on multiple projects. Tell me about your new album. Uh, it's the best music we ever made. That's all there is to say, Are you really. You're kidding me. Nothing yeah. beats still stacking. Come on. <laughs> oh, you'll be surprised. Yeah? You'll be surprised. I can't wait. Let's do some rap. Let's do some hip hop, man. Yeah. Great. Boom, bap. Guys, this is Roscoe Wiki. Hey, what's up, the party show? How you doing? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes I feel like I don't have a partner. Sometimes I feel like my only friend is the city I live in, the most livable city. Lonely as I am, together we cry. And I don't ever want to feel like I did that day. Just take me to the place I love. Take it all away. I don't ever want to feel like I did that day. Just take me to the place I love. 
take it all away Imagine if you please, imagine me on your screen Cause I am not a rapper, I'm directing movie scenes You're either friend or foe and no, there ain't no in-between Sometimes your family really ain't who it seems I guess sometimes the ends justify the means And I've wanted to do this ever since I was a teen And carpe diem, opportunities multiply when they are seen So just wake me up when I'm famous till then I'm living a dream And I don't ever wanna feel like I did that day Just take me to the place I love Take it all away I don't ever wanna I don't ever wanna feel Like I did that day Just take me to the place I love And take it all away Know the truth Hear all of the lies Then happily proceed with the truth in mind You have to be positive Cause you will find Magically the universe works for you in due time You're stuck on who is who I'm on a new design Just keep on doing you cause I'ma do fine You gotta get yours I gotta get mine Cause it's all a part of the everyday grind Motherfucker Cause I don't ever wanna feel Like I did that day Just take me to the place I love Take it all away I don't ever want to feel Like I did that day Just take me to the place I love And take it all away Party show, I say yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, shout out Sirene Party Show. I love all of you. Allie's gonna come up here and do her thing. She's the wow. I love you guys. Ah, uh, this is my viral sensation. And by that, I mean my mom has watched this video like seven times. <laughs> Where I sing. 91 different words for drunk in under a minute. So if you're good, oh, drink every time I, I sing a synonym for drunk. How about that? <laughs> in rare form, in fried and whiskey fried, ossified, tipsy and tanked and sloppy and cranked, lotto invincible, done been stinko, messed up, tore up, lubed up, boozed up, liquored up, banged up, lit up, hooched up, buzzed and jazzed and glazed and bombed, ripped and pissed and blitzed and bombed, sod and logged and corked on sober, shot and sopped and totally tober, smash, trash, bash, mash, muzzy, fuzzy, dizzy, merry, screwed and glowing and nuked and blowing a two. Soaked and jiggered and gone and piffled to stand heavy and seeing triple loaded, polluted, toasted and stupid, inebriated, intoxicated, annihilated, saturated, lubricated, marinated, retarded, obliterated, pixelated, three sheets to the wind. Licked and plowed and mellow ambushed, I cocked and silly and hammered and crushed, drenched and wrenched and slammed and wasted, corked and skunked and slushed, lambasted, blasted and plastered, shellacked and whacked and crunk and drunk. Thank you very much. Thank you so much for watching, guys. This is this is really a dream come true for Dustin. <laughs> <laughs> Give it up for Colin Chamberlain one more time. <laughs> My man Roscoe. <laughs> Ali Spagnola. Come on. Not you, Colin. You're not. Tw you're not even 21 yet. Get out of here. Ah, he is 21. Party show. That's my target market. <laughs> Guys, that's a party show. Thank you so much. You guys have a great night. The music makes me high Even though I stay away from cannabis like Wyclef Vegan and no fry sex Similar to Christ Got divine reps, so tell me If you know you're going down, why step up? Show no mercy When bruising crews Get hit with more bricks than New Jerusalem Riddles confusing fools Like a fusion rule Most cats are more square than Rubik's Cube We spit raps that are totally murderous The rhymes are like an inner kind of
bitches. My name is Dustin, and I am from Fort City, and I am real as f That kid is sexy. <laughs> so funny.